We begin tonight with the family's worst fears confirmed. A high school teacher who was missing for weeks has been found dead. Let's get right to local 10 news reporter Ian Margle live with how the beloved teacher is being remembered. So many people have been dropping by Camila Russell's family's home all day long. This family absolutely devastated and so are her former students. Here's the thing. There are still questions that are, that are left in this case. Who did this and why? A Miami-Dade schools employee found dead, bringing an end to a two week search. Family, friends and loved ones of Camila Russell gathered at the home where she was last seen on May 15th after getting the news. We, we, we just hang it in as, as, as expected. The medical examiner's office has confirmed that Russell was found floating in a canal this past Saturday. Her death is now being considered a homicide and the cause is a blunt head injury. The 41 year old was a test administrator at Miami Norland Senior High School and on Wednesday her former students reacted to the news. She was like a you know, wonderful teacher. She always liked it to smile and she always like put positive energy in people's lives. She was a very nice lady. She was so given. She was always nice to the students and she was a very nice person to be around. I love Miss Miss Russell. Last week, just down the road from the family's home, Miami Gardens police swarmed this house, bringing in canine units and drones, but still there is no official word on if these two incidents are connected. And the school district told us earlier today that they are heartbroken. They have also brought in counselors into Miami Norland Senior High School for the teachers and the students to help them get through this. Of course, there's still a lot to go into this case. We'll keep you posted with any updates. In Miami Gardens, I'm Ian Margo, Local 10 News. Really such a sad story. Thank you, Ian.